So put text behind the image. Let's pick it YouTube thumbnail. Or you can use any template or dot type of your choice. Let's go over to upload. So let's drop our image into our editor. I'm going to drag this up here and spread it out. Let me quickly close this. Let's go over to edit and come over to Magic Studio here. We'll be using the magic grab. If you see it's on click. Now we'll be clicking on this image for it to grab it for us. And I'm going to click on grab. Let me quickly close this. Now our image is grabbed away from the background. And I'm going to go over to where it says text on the side panel. And I'll click on add heading. Now let's type in our text. I will change the font of the text to leaks pattern. And I'm going to increase the font size. Let's change the font color to white. And let's go over to position here. Go over to layers and bring this text behind her. Let's click out. So the text is behind. I'll just quickly drag it up a bit. After putting the text behind your image, the good thing about Canva is that you have the opportunity to move things around. You can choose to drag this down to come a bit so the text is readable or customize it as much as you want. Subscribe to the channel for more videos like this. Do have a good one.